Do y'all remember the cheating officer that slept with like seven of her co-workers in the police station? This is an American topic. Don't worry about it. <laughs> it's not like this happens in South Africa. Right? <laughs> Don't worry. It's America. It's America. So we have a follow-up video on that. And for context, she slept with the police. She played the victim. She got money. Let's see if that's still the case, you know? Let's get into it. Let's get active. I should never say that. No, that's not me. No, let's get into it. Male officer fired in connection to Laverne Police Department scandal reaches a settlement with the city. She will receive five hundred thousand okay. dollars because she dismissed a okay. lawsuit against the city. Half a million. Charge, okay. Half a million. Half a million. For Yes, that's, that's All and four other officers were fired in January of last year yes. after an investigation showed she and other male officers had on the job and lied about it. But the lawsuit claimed that she was a victim of sexual harassment and that she was groomed. Since the investigation made national headlines, her attorney said she was publicly ridiculed, which made it difficult for her to find a job. The city did not admit any liability, and Hall settlement money will not come from taxpayer dollars. We are told the city's insurance sure. provider will pay that five hundred grand. Yeah, that's not much better because uh, who pays the insurance for these deductibles? And when that's going to skyrocket because of this lawsuit settlement, who's going to pay for that? So the taxpayers are always paying for that settlement. Yeah. Whether they're paying for the insurance for it, whether they're paying Derek. Directly or indirectly, we're still paying for it. Deduct they're paying for it. Don't say that we're not paying for it. That's cap. Taxpayers are paying for it. You guys remember this story? This um, woman who was married to a police officer at the time uh, was caught in a scandal where she was involved for up to like six other police officers. Six. I said seven. My bad. Officers, including the chief and some of the sergeants at the Dang. police department, ski, ski, exchanging nudes, you know, going ski, to do three. Ski, 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 you know. <laughs> ski, ski, ski. You know what I mean? Threesomes, foursomes, stuff with dogs, all kinds of things. It was wild, okay? Stuff with dogs. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Some dogs to want to get up in her. Because <laughs> she's built funny. Anyways. <laughs> nah, bro. I'm sorry. I think it has. <laughs> Tell you. Finally, someone said it, bro. She built like a deformed Barbie doll. She built like a freaking last minute Barbie doll. Holy good, bro. Yo. To be great, like. These guys threw away their career for a jump off and an ugly one at that. You can say it. Wow. You slept good today? You chose violence. You woke up <laughs> with that. Like, you woke up you and you said, you know what's today? Violence. But you know what? She was built, she was built different. Don't look at me like that. I'm not denying what you're saying. I know you're not. <laughs> you can't deny it. No, no, you're not. Nobody's denying deny it. it. Okay. She's a fucking okay. rider. Bro, bro, built like a fucking... <laughs> Lab rat, okay? Let's just be <laughs> Dude, you built like someone just grabbed their head in grade three and just kept smashing. Just kept mashing her head until it just looked like that. Keep it set. <laughs> you saw her face. <laughs> it is what it is. And I'm sorry, <laughs> but I'm very comfortable saying that considering how sneaky maybe. and rat like she was being in her behavior. Maybe she Oh, well, I maybe she was groomed. No, she no, wasn't. No, maybe okay? she told her that she She her. wasn't. She was trying to recruit her husband to do foursomes. She was out here sending nudes of herself. She was giving dudes fellatio on the job. And she was very much into it. She said she did it because she was having a difficult point in her marriage. Sorry. Don't pull that shit with me. Okay? Now, does that mean... And I said this before, mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. the police department has no liability? Mm -hmm. Absolutely not. Mm -hmm. They absolutely have a liability. And in fact, they have more liability in this situation. I'll say why. Because these guys were in managerial positions. They were positions of power mm -hmm. and leadership. So there's no point you should be out here with your subordinates as a public servant. Wow. I'm not paying oh, your salary what? so you can bang another cop on the job. In that case, I don't care if it's her or him. Both of them should be fired. Hmm? And I think all of you agree. Would you guys feel good if instead of doing their job, you found out two paramedics were banging in the back of the thing? Of course not. Yeah, I'd rather get an Uber to the hospital than uh, not. No, I'd rather get an Uber to the hospital. No. Yo, would you be happy if the police or the, the, the department head of your local hospital was out here banging nurses on the job? No. 
They shouldn't be doing that. It looks terrible. It invites a lot of potential lawsuits. And if you're going to be yes. that irresponsible, you should be fired. Now, the lawsuit, people say, she shouldn't be rewarded for a bad choice. And I understand that. But at the yeah. same time, I'm okay with police departments losing money so that they learn from this and never do it again. But they're not losing money. Mm-hmm. What do you mean? Is the people that are losing money. Yes. The problem comes when it's time for re-election and it's under your student that they're probably not going to re-elect you. Sure. Right? Because a lot of... Okay, they keep. There was actually some uh, council members who were against um, the lawsuit being paid up. They said, what kind of message does it send? Mm -hmm. That you can just sue our department that we're Mm -hmm. getting. So a lot of people are unhappy about this because you have to understand. And a lot of these small places like Laverne, they don't operate on an mm. unlimited budget. Yep. The budgets are limited. So when lawsuits like these come, it does affect their bottom line. It affects the rest. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Yes. yeah. Okay. Not definitely. So these are not good things for them. All this to say, no. I'm okay with the lawsuit. She's not even going to get paid that much after the lawyer takes his portion and then the taxes come in. Uh, She's yeah, probably yeah. going home with what? Wow. Well, 175? Which is... 200? Which, which is still... Which is what, like a year and a half salary? Yeah. No, she's a rookie. So no, it's like no, she got like three, four years from that. Yeah. That's still a substantial salary sure. or a pay. But the idea of you being paid that out when you leave your job is crazy. Like a lot of people will die to have that opportunity, that kind mm-hmm. of money. So, mm-hmm. yeah, I mean, this lady's going to suffer from this. It's going to be very hard for her to get any job or to go anywhere because her face is plastered. She has to move. Your she, reputation. She probably already did. I don't think she's a victim. Absolutely not. I don't think she's a victim. Do you? No. Mm-hmm. No, I think no. she is uh, suffering from it. But I don't but. see her as a victim. Yes, there was probably... I'm suffering. It was, it's more like, oh, I'm suffering. But whatever. What? <laughs> Semantics. It... Pause, bro. Pause. Hey. <laughs> I used my hand, but technically, imagine this was a penis. Now imagine there was six dudes. <laughs> that <last> Just dick. <laughs> Just dick. Now she's suffering. Just but dick. is she a victim? <laughs> I mean, I believe that it's possible that yeah, the partner, the police department, the police department was grooming, and that she was also a agreeing with that. Oh, I think okay. it's possible. Of course, she definitely agrees. There is that. grooming. There's possibility of grooming, and someone being yeah. like, you know what, yes, and being okay with it. Yeah. So I, I agree to protect and slurp. Grooming, yeah. Protect and slurp. Dude, <laughs> chill. Okay. Slob and protect. <laughs> I don't see her as a victim. I'm not like, oh. Um, um, okay. um. And according to an internal investigation, Hall hooked up with several colleagues, sent them nude pictures, and went topless in a Girls Gone Wild theme hot tub party. She also allegedly had a threesome with one of the cops and his wife. The shocking investigation report included findings that the police chief Burrell Chip Davis who was fired over the scandal, not only knew about Hall's hookups, but joked about the situation with others in the city. Who dat? Davis allegedly said when shown a vulgar photo of Hall by another cop, Ty McGowan, the investigation found. And McGowan replied, Hall, Lewis. And the chief said, shit, he on it again? What's wrong with people sometimes, bro? It's just what's wrong. That's that training day kind of shit, but instead of drugs, what's booty, wrong with people? I do understand that it was only her face that was really plastered. Plastered. I mean, that yes, we probably showed the other cops, but the one that was really advertised was her. So I can understand that. Yeah. They did, and and they are cult person as well. So you should pla- we should plaster their faces as well. Yeah, yeah, but absolutely. Like, like like her face was really like the the poster of that, and they really shamed her. And I understand how she feels. She can feel some type of weird about that. Yep. Where Fine. they're really the dudes that did wrong as well, and yep. they fucked up being. And we don't we didn't expose them as much as we did her. So I the point mm. where she's saying, "Yo, I got ridiculed." I can understand, and the media only showed her. Didn't really show them like that. I've seen a couple yeah. of pictures, but not as much just to... I could recognize her. I could pick her up. I could pick her out in the line. All right? I'd be like, yeah, that's her. That's that, yeah. that's, that's that hoe over there. Yeah, yeah. That's, <laughs> not, that's her. I could see her. That's but her. them, them tops too. And yeah. we don't, we didn't, we haven't seen them. We haven't, 
They can. Yeah. There's one video of this whole incident. Have you seen it? <laughs> Then it says something. Why are you still watching? I feel like they're gonna say something about this. Instead of a bull, imagine a black man. No, I knew it. I mean, they already had the tam tams. <laughs> <laughs> that's foul. Oh, that's just foul. Foul. So yeah, that's it, man. <clears throat> that's it. That's the update. You guys want to hear it? That's my thoughts. Your thoughts? I'm glad that they fired her. I'm glad they fired the guys too. Because if they were working under me, I would have fired every single one. The idea that coworkers out here spreading news of each other, the liability that that puts on the employer, y'all are. Stupid. Eesh. And then you guys doing that shit at work, if you get fired, I'm not going to feel it. I know a bunch of guys are like, oh, no. the woman, the woman. I don't care. Fire everybody. I feel the same about all of them. Her claiming to be a victim is an extra layer of like, yo, get the f*** out of here, but fire every single one of them. Easy. Stop being stupid at the job. Put your dick away and do your f***ing work. Put the gun down. I mean, shit. Is that <laughs> but, oh, fuck. Put it, put it down. <laughs> <laughs> what you doing? You nasty. You nasty. You nasty. Dog. No, dude. No, wow. Got him there. Every room you know, man. Every sand you know, man. That song is so good. No, bro. Just why are these guys like this? Just. Oh man, that was an Abram Peach video. <laughs> that was the update. I feel like I just gave you the whole thing. Uh, she pretended to be the victim. She getting the money. Not a lot of it, actually. But she's getting something out of it. It's unfair world. It's cruel out here, boys. Let's all hurt. I hope the husband is doing great from this. I hope some of the wives, some of those men are great. Except for the one that was in the threesome. Uh, she can go. I don't know. I don't know what happened, but... Yeah, I think I should. Hmm. The men should boys should also be posted. So I think I should make a thumbnail with all of them in it, you know. Hey, they come for me. Hey, I'm South African. You can't get me, boy. <laughs> it's been Triple Nets King. Another Aaron Peach video. It's going to be on my playlist. It's going to be on my playlist. Um, Hope you like it. Um, Hope you follow and watch the original video. Uh, it's been Triple King with another video. Peace.